It was supposed to be a night of celebration and recognition for one of Hollywood's most influential figures, but the event quickly descended into chaos when a royal interloper attempted to crash the party. The setting was the iconic Hollywood Walk of Fame, where Marvel Studios president Kevin Feige was being honored with a star on the legendary sidewalk. A who's who of A-list celebrities had gathered to pay tribute to the mastermind behind the Marvel Cinematic Universe's unprecedented success. Among the glittering crowd were A-listers like Robert Downey Jr., Scarlett Johansson, Chris Hemsworth, and many more. But before we continue, please like, subscribe, and turn on the notification bell for updates. However, the festivities were thrown into disarray when a familiar face unexpectedly arrived on the scene. Prince Harry, the Duke of Sussex. Witnesses say the royal appeared uninvited and attempted to strong-arm his way into the exclusive event, much to the chagrin of the organizers and security team. It was absolute pandemonium, recalled one onlooker. Prince Harry just showed up out of nowhere and started demanding that he be allowed inside. He was waving his arms around and causing quite a scene. I've never seen Kevin Feige look so visibly enraged. Indeed, the typically composed Feige was said to have completely lost his cool, storming over to the unwelcome guest and unleashing a torrent of angry words. Eyewitnesses report that Feige had to be physically restrained by his security detail as he attempted to forcibly remove the prince from the premises. Kevin was just fuming, another attendee shared. He was yelling at Prince Harry, telling him that this was his night and that he wasn't going to let some entitled royal ruin it. It was really quite shocking to see him lose his temper like that. The confrontation quickly spilled out onto the sidewalk, with the two men engaged in a heated exchange as the crowd looked on in stunned silence. Prince Harry, for his part, seemed unfazed by Fiji's outburst, reportedly maintaining a cool demeanor even as he was ushered off the property by security. Harry just stood there, smirking the whole time, a source close to the situation revealed. He didn't seem the least bit intimidated by Kevin's anger. It was almost like he was enjoying the drama he was causing. The incident has left many in the entertainment industry scratching their heads, wondering what could have possessed the Duke of Sussex to crash such a high-profile event. Some speculate that he may have been seeking attention or attempting to insert himself into the spotlight, while others believe he may have had more nefarious motives. It's just really bizarre, remarked one Hollywood insider. Kevin Feige is one of the most important figures in the industry, and this was a major night for him. For Prince Harry to just barge in and try to steal the spotlight is just incredibly disrespectful. Despite the disruption, the ceremony eventually resumed, with Feige graciously accepting his star on the Walk of Fame to thunderous applause from the assembled crowd. In his speech, he made no mention of the earlier incident, choosing instead to focus on the incredible journey that had led him to this moment. It's been an incredible honor to be a part of bringing these beloved characters to life on the big screen, Feige told the audience. I've been blessed to work with some of the most talented and passionate people in the industry, and this star is a testament to their hard work and dedication. As for Prince Harry, he quietly slipped away from the event, leaving behind a trail of bewildered onlookers and a seething Kevin Feige. The incident has only added to the growing perception of the Duke as a somewhat erratic and attention-seeking figure, a far cry from the more reserved and dignified royal persona he had cultivated in the past. It's just such a shame that something like this had to happen on such a special night, lamented one attendee. Kevin Feige deserves all the recognition in the world, and it's a real shame that Prince Harry had to come in and try to ruin it. In the end, the evening belonged to Feige who was able to bask in the well-deserved adulation of his peers and fans. But the memory of the prince's unwelcome intrusion will likely linger, a bizarre and unexpected chapter in the illustrious career of one of Hollywood's most influential figures.